Queen Shajarat el Dur was a powerful female leader in the Muslim world who lived in the 13th century. Her life story is full of political intrigue, rebellion, and ultimately tragedy. Shajarat el Dur was born in the 13th century in the region that is now modern-day Turkmenistan. She was originally a slave in the royal household of the Ayyubid Sultanate, a Muslim empire that ruled over parts of Egypt and the Levant. It is believed that she was originally from the region of Sakasha, in the northern Caucasus. At some point, Shajarat el Dur was sold to the powerful Muslim general and ruler of Egypt, Saladin. Saladin recognized Shajarat el Dur's intelligence and beauty and took her as one of his wives. She quickly became one of his most trusted advisors and confidants. After Saladin's death in 1193, his sons inherited the empire. However, they were unable to hold onto power for long and were eventually overthrown by the Mamluks, a group of slave soldiers who had risen up within the empire. In 1250, the Mamluks successfully seized control of Egypt and established their own dynasty. During this time, Shajarat el Dur had become a powerful figure in the royal court. She had married the last Ayyubid ruler of Egypt, Al Saleh Ayyub, and had become a prominent figure in his government. When Al Saleh Ayyub died in 1249, Shajarat el Dur took control of the empire in her own right. She declared herself the Sultana of Egypt, becoming the first and only woman to ever hold that title. Shajarat el Dur's reign was short lived, however. The Mamluks were unhappy with her rule and demanded that she step down in favor of one of their own. Shajarat el Dur refused, and the Mamluks launched a full scale rebellion against her. She led her army in battle, but she was ultimately defeated and captured. The Mamluks were ruthless in their treatment of Shajarat el Dur. They stripped her of her royal title, shaved her head, and publicly humiliated her. She died shortly after, either from suicide or from injuries sustained during her capture and imprisonment. Despite her tragic end, Shajarat el Dur is remembered as a powerful and influential leader who challenged gender norms and defied expectations. Her reign as Sultana was a groundbreaking moment in Muslim history, and her legacy continues to inspire women around the world to this day. Shajarat el Dur's legacy also includes her role in the founding of the Mamluk dynasty, which ruled Egypt for several centuries. After her capture and death, the Mamluks consolidated their power and became one of the most powerful empires in the Muslim world. In addition to her political achievements, Shajarat el Dur is also remembered for her religious piety and devotion to Islam. She was known to be a deeply spiritual person who regularly gave to charity and performed acts of kindness for the poor and needy. Despite her status as a slave and a woman in a male-dominated society, Shajarat el Dur was able to rise to a position of great power and influence through her intelligence, determination, and political savvy. Her story is a testament to the fact that even in the face of adversity and oppression, it is possible to achieve great things. Today, Shajarat el Dur is celebrated as a feminist icon in many parts of the Muslim world, particularly in Egypt. Her legacy has inspired countless women to pursue their dreams and break down barriers in a variety of fields, from politics to the arts to education. Overall, the story of Shajarat el Dur's life is a powerful reminder of the importance of perseverance, courage, and faith in the face of adversity. She is a true hero and a role model for generations to come.